Jesus rose. Jesus rose from the dead. He is alive. Hmm, so what now? What now? We need we need the next step. We Verse need fight. 19, we two, sometimes three, need a conversation. We need a helper. Verse we need instruction. We need to know that Jesus forgives us. What do you need to share the good news? Go. Down. Always to be It's me again. Sing a song with me, okay? The nations and then make the people my disciples. Baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And remember, you are never alone. I am with you always to be. song so much those are jesus's words you know friend go to all the nations and make disciples tell them of all the good news baptize them and remember this song's words come from the bible and it's really jesus's words it gives us instructions. Do you know what instructions are? I didn't know what they are. It's a big word for such a little sheep like me. So I went and asked Lola. She also didn't know, but she pretended she did, even though she actually just used Google. Anyway, she said that it's an, that instructions explain step by step what to do. Jesus, is, Jesus explains to us step by step what he wants us to do. I want to do what Jesus asks me to do. Do you want to, friend? Yep, I knew you did. Then let's listen to the great commission and what it means let's read together from the New Testament from Matthew 28 verse 19 to 20 therefore go and make disciples of all nations baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit and teaching them to obey everything I have commanded you and surely I am with you always to the very end of the age. Jesus lived on earth. He then died on the cross, but he rose again from the dead. Just before he went up to heaven and gave us our helper, the Holy Spirit, he gave instructions to his disciples and to us. Instructions tell us step by step what to do. Let's remember these four words. Go, baptize, teach, remember. Will you say them with me? Go, go, baptize, baptize, teach, teach, remember, remember. The first word, go, means we must go with Jesus to people to tell them about his love. You can maybe go to your teacher or your friend and tell them about Jesus. We must go where Jesus sends us. Now let's see what the second word means. Baptize. This helps each one of us to realize that we are forgiven and part of God's family. It's a great gift. We call it grace. We see that he loves us and we want to follow him in everything we do and say. The third word, teach. We must go and teach everyone how to be disciples of Jesus. 
This means we must tell everyone we see and meet about Jesus and teach them how to follow him. We can teach them what Jesus teaches us. We can also show others through what we do and say how to do and say what Jesus asks of us. The last word, remember. Think about it again and again that you are never alone. Jesus, the Holy Spirit, God is always with us. He's with us, with us on this very important mission. Will you hear this great commission, what Jesus tells us to do, and say yes to it? It's quite exciting, right, friend? We are on this very important mission with Jesus. Matthew 28, verse 19 to 20 says, Matthew 28, verse 19 to 20 says, Go to all the nations and then make the people my disciples. Baptize them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And remember you are never a to go and tell everyone about you. This news has to be shared. Teach us how to tell everyone of your love. Thank you for always going with us. Yes, always. Amen. <laughs> 